Hey everyone, imagine I have an SVG right here. It's inside an element with class loader. It's a circle. Well, it's not full circle, but to 70 degrees. And it has an animate transform inside. And when you load this, here's what happens. It does one full iteration and then stops because it has repeat count of one. And imagine that in the test, you want to confirm that the loader is visible, which is what I'm doing right here. I'm getting the element with class loader and inside the child SVG and should be visible and that works. But imagine your application is doing something after the SVG animation finishes. How would you wait from your test for this animate transform to finish? Well, the test is running inside the browser. So here's what you can do. From your SVG, you can find the animate transform element this is this element and this will give you a jquery object and you can invoke the jquery method on and subscribe to the event the svg animations have an event a minute when we finish and you can pass a callback and we can construct our own function and give it an alias like animate okay so we literally just register our own callback to get called when the application finishes the animation. And if we want to wait and continue the rest of the test, all we have to do, we can get this animate spy and say should have been called. That's it. Now the test will wait, confirm it was called, the animate transform finished, and then it will continue the rest of the commands. Pretty cool.